It's another Bob Bob Blast mystery box. Blaster, these are my favorite. What do we got today? Huh? Whoa! There's lots of cool stuff in here. Like this big red snake blaster. Wow, look at it. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Slithering away. Look at them slither, slither. The snake slithers. I love snakes. I'd like to go see some snakes in their natural habitat. What about you, Blaster? Okay, here we go. Blaster, let's dive down to the ocean and check out some sea snakes. These snakes spend their lives in and around salt water. They come in lots of different colors. Hey, Blaster, true or false? These sea snakes have learned to anchor themselves to the sandy bottom. Well, that'd be false. They actually aren't a type of snake at all, Blaster. I gotcha. These are actually known as garden eels, and they are a type of fish. Hey, Blaster, does that earn us our snake card? Awesome. Snakes are super superb. <laughs> Let's see what else is in the mystery box. Oh, look, Blaster. The mystery box has a Baba Blast t-shirt. That's awesome. Thanks to everyone who goes to babablast.com and picks up one of the t-shirts. It helps us make these videos. Awesome, Blaster. Whoa, look at this. It's an eagle. But this eagle can do something cool. If you take your finger and place the beak of this eagle right on the tip of your finger. Ta-da! Perfect balance, I love it. Remember when we went to the lake and saw those eagles? Well, eagles are pretty cool, but do you know the fastest animal in the world? It's also a bird. It's not an eagle, it's a peregrine falcon. Let's see them in action. You wouldn't win a race against a peregrine falcon. They can reach a top speed of 242 miles per hour. The peregrine falcon is a type of... That's right, it's a type of falcon. <laughs> Falcons have a sharp tooth at the very tip of their strong beak. They also use their nails, called talons, to catch their prey. Hey, Blaster, we definitely earned our falcon card. Falcons, eagles, all amazing to me. Here, eagle, you can balance right there. Oh, speaking of animals, look at this shark. And it has a little twisty thing on the bottom. And if you twist it, one, two, three, four, five, it swims. There it goes. Nice. I wonder how well this would swim in the water. Should we try it out? All right, let's go. Oh, Blaster, this is a perfect place for us to try out this new shark toy. Let's try it. One, two, oh, it's ready to swim. Three, four, five. All right, let's see what happens when we put it in the water. Go, shark. All right, he's moving, he's moving, he's moving. Not the fastest shark, but he's trying as hard as he can. I got you, Mr. Shark. Very nice. Now this part of the shark is called the what? That's right, the dorsal fin. And guess what this tail is called? That's right, just its tail. That was perfect. Sometimes things aren't so hard. Let's go back to the mystery box. Let's see what else is in the mystery box. Oh. Do you know what these are called? It has two words. A magnifying glass. Magnifying glass. This helps make things look bigger when you look through it. Whoa, you look really big. What about you, Blaster? There you go. Here's what it looks like when you look through a magnifying glass. Nice, now you know. Oh, we all love dinosaurs. Dinos are some of my favorite animals. And look what this one does, Blaster. You put your hand in it, and then you can move it like this. Blaster, I'm going to eat you. 
plaster. Just kidding. We're just ma playing make-believe. Cool dinosaur puppet. Goodbye. Oh, speaking of dinosaurs, look at this one, Blaster. It looks like a Triceratops, but its arms seem different. Whoa. Come on, arm. Come on. There it is. I think if you take this, yeah, it sticks right on your arm. Oh, until it doesn't. It gave me a nice little hug. Thanks, Triceratops. Fun. Hey, this one needs to be put back together. Let's see if we can guess what kind of animal this is. Any guesses? Maybe a cheetah? I don't know. What about if we add some legs to it? There we go. Any guesses now? Maybe some more legs will help. Oh, I think I know what it is. Do you know? I think you'll get it once we put the last piece together. That's right, it's a giraffe. The longest necks in the world. Incredible. Let's go see some giraffes in action. What do we need to know to win our giraffe card blaster? Ah, good idea. Okay, here we go. Do you know how long a giraffe's tongue is? Is it A, seven inches, B, 14 inches, or C, 20 inches? It's C. A giraffe's tongue can reach a length of 20 inches. All right, Blaster, giraffe card, please. I think my favorite part of the giraffe isn't the neck, but their awesome tongue. Very cool, Blaster, thanks. Speaking of animals, I got another one for you. C-O-W, that's how you spell cow. C-O-W, wow, wow, wow. Nice, I love cows. We get lots of stuff from cows, and one of them, you got it, milk. Yum. Hey, I don't know what kind of animal this is. What is this? Hmm. Looks like a armadillo or a anteater, but it's not. Blaster, let's go learn what these animals are. What are these, Blaster? Let's spell it. P-A-N-G-O-L-I-N. Oh, it's a pangolin. Pangolins are often referred to as scaly anteaters. Because, like anteaters, pangolins eat using their sticky tongue. Blaster, what's with all the talk about tongues lately? <laughs> what's the pangolin card look like? Ooh, nice, Blaster, awesome. We've covered a lot of animals, like this one, but there's so many other things that we can use to find animals out in the open, like these binoculars. Like a magnifying glass, this allows you to see things that are far away. Wow, I can see all over. Blaster, I'm sorry. Here you go. Hello over there, you look really close. Thanks for the binoculars, Blaster. What a fun mystery box. What is this next item? Oh, it's a circle and it has four letters around it. The first one is N. The second one is E, the third one is S, and the fourth one is W. I know what this is, Blaster. This is called a compass. And when you put it flat, it will tell you which direction is where. These will be great if we're on the hunt for some animals. Cool compass, Blaster. Hey, this doesn't look like anything to do with animals, but it's really fun. It's a little grabber. So if something's far away, let's see if I can grab, I think I'm gonna try to grab this dinosaur puppet. Let's see if I can. Yeah, I did it, the grabber works. There you go, dino. Let's see if I can grab the giraffe head. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> what about now? Oh, so close. 
There, we got it. Oh, I think the giraffe is too heady, heavy, but the dinosaur puppet is the perfect weight. Nice. Wow, we have a few more items in the mystery box. Hey, what is this? A telescope? I don't think it's a telescope blaster. No, in fact, it's a kaleidoscope. Now you can't see in here exactly, but Blaster, can you show them what a kaleidoscope looks like when you look through it? Awesome. Check this out, guys. Kaleidoscopes are really fun. We can use this later. There's only a few items left. I can't wait to see the next one. Hey, another dinosaur head. But this is a finger puppet. This one allows you to move the tongue up and down and all around. Hey, this could be fun to play with. Hello, thank you for watching Ba Ba Blast. Have a great day. <laughs> I'm just being goofy. One of the largest animals in the world is the white rhino. Look how big their horn is at the front of their nose. Hey Blaster, you know what I want. Let's go check out some rhinos. Hey Blaster, you know, the white rhino kind of reminds me of hippos. Yeah, those. But did you know that one white rhino can weigh as much as five hippos? Huh, that's more than 5,000 pounds. This means the white rhino is the largest of all the rhinos. This is going to be a cool card blaster, I can tell. Whoa! There's only one item left in the mystery box. What is it going to be? A big one? A small one? Here we go! Oh, it's a tiny one. It's a little slap bracelet. But this isn't just any slap bracelet. This has a whole bunch of kitty cats on this side. Gray ones, orange ones, white ones. Aw, very cute. But it also on the other side has a ruler. Awesome! Blaster, I've never measured you. How big are you? Blaster is 12 inches. Oh, <laughs> did you see that? It flipped out with, I wasn't even finished with it. 12 inches plus six inches is 18 inches. That's how big you are, Blaster, 18 inches. <laughs> this is a tricky bracelet, but I think I figured it out. Nice. Now it looks perfect. Well, that was a fun mystery box. See you on the next one, bye.